have a rocks box to share with you. Now I'm doing it a little different than the uh, previous videos because I want to try to get through um, showing you what um, came in my box a little bit faster. So what I decided to do is to go into the box, put on some of the pieces that match with what I have on, and then um, you'll already see it on. So one of the items is this ring. Everything comes in a cute rocks box, um, box like this. It's nicely um, tied with the ribbon. It comes in a little padded, a little envelope. The envelope you save, and then you put the return label that they will have enclosed on the outside, and then you just give it to your UPS driver or you schedule pick up or drop it off at your local post office. But when you open the box, it is wrapped in this particular type of tissue paper. Um, more like this, you have a little sticker on the top which says enjoy. And then when you open it up, let me move that right there, you'll have three little sachets. Each sachet will contain whichever piece of jewelry was sent. Now, you can allow your stylist to randomize pull pieces for you and ship what she's pulled. You do get a notification to um, go in and view what your st your jeweler stylist um, pull for you. She will typically, he or she, will typically pull from what's on your wish list. Your wish list is as it is described. It is where you go through their catalog, which is pretty large, of different um, jewelry brands and types. You can search by necklace, bracelet, earrings, rings, like that, or you can sh uh, look by brand, or you can look by coming soon or um, just arrived. So you have different ways you can search if you just don't wanna go down a very long, tedious list. Needless to say, you can click um, a heart or something like that and those pieces that you are interested in trying will get added to your wish list. So when your stylist goes in to curate your next box, they'll pull an item or two from that wish list and then they'll pull some pieces that you didn't select that they think you may be interested in. You do have the option to leave it as so or to swap out a particular piece or all of them and that's what I did. I'm always swiping out stuff, leave it be. Because when you do your wish list, if you don't go back in and play around with it and take things off, your, your attitude can change about something that you wanted to try um, earlier. You get a little um, Time to Shine booklet. On the back it says what happens next. So it gives you some um, breakdown instructions. And then in the inside is your invoice. And so it tells you what each piece is and how much it will be. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna show you is the Sofa Sophie Harper Arrow Ring in Gold. Retail price for this ring is $50 and they're selling it for 42 and I kind of dig it. I like it. I like the size that I think I went with a nine and this is a little big. I'm like an eight and a half because if I went with an eight then it would have been too tight. But I like it. I mean worse come to worse. I think um, there's like a little ring you can go to look it up on Amazon or a jeweler in the mall and you can get a little something to kind of wrap around it or old school it, put some tape, but I would like to not go that go there. All right, the next thing we have here is this necklace by Aster, A-S-T-E-R, and um, it says granted wish. So this was on my wish list, the Celestial Evil Eye Charm Pendant in Gold, and I'm gonna come closer. And it does, as you can see, which should be behind my neck, but it has an extension. So it can be um, made to be shorter or longer. I'm gonna pause and make it longer. Okay, so I, lent, uh, I made the chain longer, and this is about where it drops. Now, the, the loop, the little hole in the back, I'm on the second, second or third to the last, absolute last one. So I can drop down just a smidget lower than what you see here. And this Celestial Evil 
Eye Charm Pendant in Gold is $55 and it has a retail price of $65. And I do like this. I like the um, Crescent, Half Crescent Moon. I do like the Evil Eye. It's to kind of ward off any um, negative energy or um, evil thoughts that someone could be trying to protrude and have come your way. It's kind of like... Uh, as in scripture, like the shield armor of protection. So it's to kind of block and keep those type of vibes from penetrating and um, the crescent moon and the, the, what the lunar um, represents and the power of the moon is pretty cool. You can do your own personal research on that. And the last thing that I wanna show you guys is these earrings. And there are some hoop earrings I do like enameled jewelry. I've said that in a previous video. And I want to say these come in white as well. I'm trying to get it where you guys can see it. And I'm going to take it out just so you can kind of see the scale of them. That's the tricky thing for me with hoop earrings and some of their jewelry pieces have photos where it's on a person and some of them don't. It's that you don't quite know um, where it's going to fall because they don't always list it and say, you know, this is a two and a half inch drop or something like that. So you're really winging it sometimes. But again, the good thing is you can get multiple boxes in one month um, under your $21, $25 credit and ship back and forth within that 30 day time frame and try out different pieces. So this is where it drops. This is what they look like. I like it. I think um, it's a nice casual pair of earrings and they can even work back to that bracelet set that I purchased from not the last box but the box before last. Grand total for all these items would be $135. There is a keep all discount of $10 which would bring it to $125. Then I have the $21 credit. So it bring it to 104 for if I was to keep everything, which I'm somewhat leaning towards. So I'll get to play out in this jewelry. I'll probably hang on to it about a week, try to make a decision to see what I'm going to keep, what I'm not going to keep, or if I'm going to keep all of it. And I'll let you guys know in the next um, Rocks Box video what my final decision was on that. Um, but I do like everything and I really like this, the size of the hoops and the coloring. And I think if I keep these at 38, I'm sorry if I didn't mention who makes these, but these are Perry Street Maddie Hoops and Blush and they're $38. And, and like I said, I want to say there's one other color option. I would want these in that other color option because I'm for the most part a pretty um, casual dresser or business casual dresser and for, for the places that I go um, this style of earrings wouldn't be um, out of place so thanks for hanging out with me if you want to give rocks box a try look in the description box below or the first comment I'll have it pinned with my referral link which would grant you $21 and if you complete the wish list profile um, you'll get an additional $5 and you can have um, a rocks box box sent out to you I want to say for free because they'll charge a card to make sure it the funds is there um, but then they'll refund it to you and so I think your initial box is free because not only do they do that they take um, refund you but they still uh, put a 21 25 dollars something like that credit into your account so if you like something from your box or next box that money or credit will be available to you Thanks for spending time with my channel. Thank you for the new subbies. Thank you, Kayla, for the shout out. I appreciate that, as well as Georgia Sunshine a couple of weeks ago. Also recommended my channel. You ladies are just beautiful, and I'm just so happy to um, have discovered you guys. You, you just... So thanks. Thanks so much, everybody, for watching. Have a blessed day, everyone.